Greetings everyone, this is Angela with another Sisterhood Agenda video. And this video is going to be a little bit different as we're going to talk about hobbies today. So please subscribe so that you won't miss out on any more life-changing content. So what we're going to talk about now are hobbies. Hobbies are great to have, they're wonderful to engage in, and quite frankly, everyone needs a hobby. Indulging yourself in various activities has been proven to be beneficial to a woman's overall wellness. In addition to discovering new skills, it can be your momentary pause from your busy life, your way to reset and recharge, and your hobby can even help with mental health because it clears your headspace. The benefit of starting a hobby is a never-ending list, and that is exactly the reason why you should start one. Cultivate a green thumb. As a hobby, I'd like to focus on indoor plants to rev up your interest in plants. The craze for house plants has grown immensely in 2020, which we all know that the pandemic has played a great part in. It's no doubt that plants add life to stark spaces, but apart from the overall appearance of a space, indoor plants boost moods, they increase creativity, reduce stress and eliminate air pollutants, which can make us all feel good and healthier. Caring for plants not only encourages self-care and nurturing, but also creates a community in a world where there's often a disconnect. How, you might ask. There are various plant clubs you can join. You can also swap plants with other plant parents and join various plant shows. It's a good thing that all these things can be done both in person and online, so you can do whatever suits you and whatever you are comfortable with. Don't be scared to start. If you don't have any experience with plants, there are a lot of plants for beginners that are low maintenance. That could be a good start. Cooking. If you are still not into cooking, this could be the sign that you're looking for. Cooking may rank as the most useful of the hobbies you can learn, and it can be as simple or complex as you want. As compared to 10 or 20 years ago, when the main guides for cooking were bulky print books that weren't always easy to follow, Technology has made quick and easy resources available online. Apart from the fact that cooking your own meal is economical, a lot of people attest to the fact that it's a good stress reliever and can definitely bring a smile to your face and those you care about. Yoga. If you want a hobby that would give you glowing skin, a fitter body, and a relaxed mind, there's no other way to go than starting yoga. It helps boost energy levels that will help keep you going throughout the day, irrespective of your age. What I like most about yoga is that it is holistic, extremely beneficial, and it doesn't require special equipment. Plus, you can do it anywhere. All you have to do is to learn yoga online or sign up for a class to learn the basics, and you can practice everything else at home, just for additional information. Doing yoga with your spouse can increase your intimacy and improve your love life. If this is something you'd like to work on, get your yoga mat now and begin learning those poses. Learn a new language. Women are instinctively great at connecting with other people, but this can be difficult when language barriers come into play. If you plan to visit a new country, if you are fascinated with foreign television, shows, or music, or if you just want to be bilingual, then this could be the hobby you might want to delve into. Learning a new language as a hobby is very fascinating, fun, and fulfilling, and will allow you to get a better sense of another country's culture and way of thinking. Tap into your inner artist. If you like to color, draw, sketch, or paint as a child, you have artistic potential that can be tapped into and developed as an adult. Even if you never did any of these things when you were younger, it's never too late to try and learn. In addition to being a great vehicle for self-expression, more adults are discovering coloring books and how to manage everyday stress through art. So grab a pencil or a marker, be creative, and get going. It may sound simple, but starting a hobby will help encourage you to seek out the good in life no matter what your present circumstances are. Share your hobbies in the comments below. And thank you for sharing. And most of all, thank you for putting sisterhood on your agenda.